Hey guys, it's Fellastorm coming at you with a top 10 list. With Pokemon Sword and Shield out today, bringing the tally of Pokemon well over a thousand, I thought I'd take a look back at some of my favourite Pokemon you choose at the very start of your adventure. This is my top 10 starting Pokemon list. At number 10, Piplup, Pokemon Diamond, Pearl and Platinum. Mimicking the image of a baby penguin, this Pokemon is perfect for any bird lover. With a mixture of flying and water abilities, this little blue wonder stood out in Pokemon Diamond and Pearl. Number 9, Chikorita, Pokemon Gold, Silver and Crystal. Remember when there was only 150 Pokemon? Well, that number has most certainly increased. Since then, with Chikorita kicking off a second generation of Pokemon, and is my personal favourite from gold and silver versions. Number 8, Torchic, Pokemon Ruby and Sapphire. Looking like a newly hatched chick, Torchic is the fire equivalent of Piplup. Despite its cute as a button exterior, this Pokemon packs a powerful fiery punch. Still, that shouldn't stop you from wanting to give it a big warm hug. Number 7, Fennekin, Pokemon X and Y. Fennekin is a Firefox, but sadly nothing to do with the web browser. This Pokemon will set its challenges ablaze and warm your hearts in the process. Number 6, Oshawott, Pokemon Black and White. Now, a seashell might not seem like a deadly weapon, especially in the hands of this sea otter looking Pokemon. Well, guess again. This gives Oshawott a competitive edge in battle, acting as both a sword and shield. Number 5, Pikachu, Pokemon Yellow. Just like in the anime, this electric mouse Pokemon follows you wherever you go. Reluctant to go inside its Pokeball, loyal and lovable, it's no wonder this Pokemon is the mascot for the entire franchise. Number 4, Bulbasaur, Pokemon Red and Blue. Now, it may not be as popular as its fire and water counterparts, but at least he will be always the number one Pokemon in the official Pokedex. While not everyone chose Bulbasaur at first, it's hard to ignore this seed Pokemon with the appearance of a mini dinosaur. Number 3, Mudkip, Pokemon Ruby and Sapphire. As well as being one of the best water type Pokemon of any game, able to learn fighting, rock and psychic moves, this Pokemon is truly versatile and damn near impossible to stop in battle. Number 2, Squirtle, Pokemon Red and Blue. Now, turtles may be slow and laid back animals, but Squirtle is one of the most lively, coolest Pokemon you'll ever meet. How many Pokemon can you think of that can pull off wearing sunglasses? Easily one of the best Pokemon in the franchise, especially when it reaches its tank-like final form, this would have been my top choice had it not been for one fiery contender. And number one, Charmander, Pokemon Red and Blue. Was there any doubt that Charmander would be the top pick? With a cheerful smile and flaming tail, this lizard Pokemon is cute as it is fierce. But let's face it, the main reason everyone picks Charmander is so that it can eventually evolve into Charizard, a fan favourite of the franchise. And that's my list. Which Pokemon did you choose in the latest edition of the franchise? Just leave a comment below and don't forget to like, share and subscribe to keep up to date with all future content. Bye bye for now.